Okay, so this is the Playwright Irish Pub on Miami Beach. Uh, this is one of my favorite places. I'm going to tell you a quick story about it. But I also see that uh, if this is a crushing heartbreak for me. It's it's for rent. They, they couldn't make it. And um, so my best memory of this place over the years, uh, I got back to Miami in 1998. Here we are in 2021, so that's however many years it is, 23 maybe. Um, I picked up a young lady here and took her home about a half a mile from here. Uh, she lived on South Beach. And I had trouble understanding her. So uh, young blonde, let's say um, 20. Um, and so I said, uh, I, I said, why do I have trouble understanding you? She said, well, I, I just arrived from Ireland. <laughs> right? So like here she is working at the Irish pub. She had been in this country, uh, you know, let's just say, I don't know, maybe two months working here and her Irish brogue or Irish accent was so thick you could barely understand it, but that's what made this place so authentic. Um, one one day I, I bought a um, bangers and mash, which may not even be Irish, I found out later, but it was really the first time I ever had it. Have you ever had bangers and mash? Um, I took it um, over to the golf course and parked my taxi, this was years ago before Uber, and um, some ducks walked up from the golf course we're on Miami Beach and shared some of my food with me. It's the first time I ever fed ducks and realized they're like pets or like dogs. They walked right up to me and I, I gave them a little bit of my bangers and mash. So this, this is a hard fall for me. Um, quite honestly, uh, it wouldn't surprise me that this can't be laid on the doorstep of um, Mayor Dan Gelber, who I think is actually, in my opinion now, this is my opinion, deliberately trying to destroy uh, our tourist industry because he wants to take Miami Beach back to the days when it was a New York retirement community. Uh,